in the Chronicles of the Past, 479 BC symbolizes a pivotal confrontation about to take place. Known as the Battle of Plataea, this momentous showdown was filled with suspense. Valiant warriors from both factions pledged their commitment to the looming face-off, bravely confronting their destiny. The atmosphere was dense, permeated with the electrifying scent of impending conflict. It stood for more than a mere skirmish, it represented a testament to human bravery and persistence. The potential downfall or ascension of empires relied on this enormous confrontation. As the world watched on edge, its fate fluctuating, the outcome would etch the trajectory of civilizations. The combatants, shouldering the hopes of the globe, persevered. The future of nations teetered on the edge. On one side there stood the mighty Persian Empire ruled by King Xerxes. This flourishing empire stretched from the arid deserts of Egypt to the bustling cities of Asia Minor. Its military, a large and diverse entity, had a single goal. Conquest. The army, composed of lethal warriors, skilled archers, and agile horsemen, was always prepared for battle. Their gleaming weapons under the sun and war cries echoing across the terrain mirrored the undeniable might of their king. Each soldier encapsulated a relentless quest for power. They epitomized the very notion of authority and dominance. Standing in opposition, the Greek polis, unified in their quest for freedom. Their motivation was rooted in tenacity, and the spirit of resilience, even when outnumbered and out-equipped. Their power was not in the multitude, but in the enduring fortitude born out of their affection for their homeland and treasured liberties. This fortitude, reflecting their lineage, was closely tied to the safeguarding of traditions and the dignity of their civilization. They were the carriers of hope, prepared to shield their city-state's legacy, regardless of the circumstances. Their bravery represented a symbol of steadfast resolve. Their determination focused on defending their land, their lifestyle. On the 14th of October, 1066, as the first light of dawn pierced the sky on this significant day, anticipation hung palpably in the air. The imminent turmoil cast a shadow over the battlefield, with a peaceful sunrise acting as a prelude to a deadly showdown. Two tenacious heavily forces lined up, their breath forming a mist in the chill morning air. Warriors, their armor catching the sun's first rays, clutched gleaming swords, harbingers of the forthcoming devastation. The restless, shuffling horses reverberated in the silence, punctuated by the distant calls of hawks. Tranquility shattered abruptly as the uproar erupted akin to an unexpected storm. The dissonant sound of clashing swords, thunderous galloping of horses, and the anguished cries of the wounded filled the air. The battle ensued relentlessly, with no signs of capitulation from either faction. Amidst the turmoil, the Hellenic forces battered yet steadfast, held their ground. Their tenacity served as a beacon of aspiration, their resolve reflecting their undying loyalty to kin, culture, and homeland. In stark contrast, the Persians, audacious in demeanor and robust in spirit, pressed on. Their belief in their superior numbers was palpable. Functioning like components a large war machine, they progressed fearlessly, with dreams of glory and victory propelling their steps. This robust assurance and unyielding courage added fuel to their inexorable march, escalating the battle's ferocity. As time ticked away, a significant transformation took hold of the battlefield. The Greeks, fueled by resolve and national love, reassembled. They adapted their strategies into calculated maneuvers, demonstrating a regimented power. The soldiers maintained their territories, their stairs reflected their grit. Their phalanxes, combined with shields and spears, resisted the Persian onslaught. Arms, gleaming under the sun, turned into symbols of their steady spirit, instigating turmoil. The Persians, hitherto unbeatable, observed the Greeks' steadfast progression. Their armaments persistently infiltrated the opposition defenses. The Persians, once perceived as an indomitable power sweeping across the world, found themselves at an unexpected junction. Their erstwhile unconquerable force was now ensnared, their confidence dwindling, uncertainty and apprehension began to infiltrate their ranks. Their formerly formidable weapons were now weakened by internal skepticism. Sensing this change, the smaller yet determined Greek forces were galvanized. Driven by this shift, they regained their resolve. The scent of victory permeating the air only intensified their determination. Motivated by the tantalizing promise of triumph, they advanced with fervor. As the prospect of victory loomed closer, the Greeks' determination surged, and they continued their march unabated. As the fierce rivalry heightened, 
signs of weakening emerged in the Persian lines. Disarray and fear washed over them, signaling an imminent loss. Their once intimidating demeanor now lay in ruins, their coherence shattered. Unyielding and steadfast, the Greeks maintained their ground. Amidst the blinding sun reflecting off gleaming armors, they watched as their adversaries fell back. Such a sight stirred the soul, a clear proof of their unbroken spirit. Amid the turmoil, one fact was crystal clear. Overcoming all obstacles, the Greeks were on the cusp of victory. The Battle of Plataea was a historical turning point. It rattled the vast territories of the Persian Empire, halting their ambitions of expansion and altering their course permanently. The conflict was more than just a display of Greek military superiority, it was a testament to the resolute strength of collaboration. Warriors battled not solely for territorial claims, but for liberty and dignity. Their shared resolve shone like a lighthouse amidst the shadows, attesting to the durability of mankind. It underlined the power inherent in unity, drawing attention to the determination inherent in the human condition. As the dust particles subsided and jubilant cries dissolved into the air, the survivors faced the grim aftermath. The battlefield lay bare with its horrors, its silence uncovering countless tragedies. A once idyllic meadow, transformed into an impromptu cemetery, bore the weight of fallen warriors, their bodies marred with scars of the ordeal. The vibrant landscape was now a grotesque portrayal of war. A sporadic sob punctuated the scene, narrating a tale of the inherent cost of such a devastating clash, a cost now dreadfully apparent. The once bustling terrain stood desolate, the cost of liberty exacted with human blood. The Battle of Plataea stands as a steadfast testament to the sacrifices made in the relentless pursuit of freedom. Fought over two millennia ago, this series of martial confrontations echoes throughout history. It wasn't merely a demonstration of military strength, but an homage to the resilient human spirit. Those who fought were more than soldiers, they were embodiments of a nation yearning for liberation. Their courage was born from a deep-seated belief in the sanctity of freedom. Fear did not deter them, and their brave deeds left an indelible mark, inspiring to come. Their legacy has spurred countless others to fight for their rights, serving as a perpetual source of motivation, a beacon of hope for all those steadfast in their pursuit of liberty.